everyone! Are you wondering what your current grade is in your class? Or even just what your progress is? Well, today I'm going to be going over how to check your grades and truly understand that portion, along with your course progress and your course report. All of these tools are incredibly important to being successful on Edgenuity. So let's get into it. If you want to know your current grade and how much progress you've made in your class, then you need to head to your course progress. To do this, start by logging into Edgenuity. This will take you to your dashboard where you will see the tiles for each course. From here, click on the course map icon in the upper right corner of the tile for the course you want to review. This will bring you to your course map page. Head to the left side and click on the graph icon. Here, you'll see your progress overview. There are a few things to take a look at on this page. First, let's review your actual grade. This percentage is calculated by the work you have completed so far. This is your true grade and will indicate how you're doing in the class. Next, let's talk about the relative grade. You might notice that this grade is less than your actual grade. This is because it shows you what your grade would be if you totally stopped your course today, did not finish the rest of the work, and received a zero on all of the unfinished activities. Your relative grade may be used as a way to complete your course. If you hit 60% on your relative grade in your course, your course may be deemed finished. If you'd like a higher GPA, you can continue in the course and finish at 100%. Both your relative grade and your actual grade are equally as important, so ensure you're paying attention to both. Now, you might be wondering what the large colored bar is on this page and the percentage that hovers above it. This is your student progress bar. It shows you how far you have progressed through your course so far. The bar can change color depending on progress made and if you're staying on track or falling behind based on your target completion date. Let's take a look at the student progress percentage. This percentage shows you how far you are as a percentage of the total classwork. For example, if it says 75%, you are 75% done with your course. Remember, if it shows 100%, then you've completed your course. Now, look at the bottom right corner of the section. You should have a target date. This is the date you should have your course completed by. Now, your bar will change color depending on how fast you progress in your course and if you are staying on schedule. For example, if your target date to complete your course is in two weeks, but you're only 45% done with your class, the bar will be red, showing that you are really behind. If you are 75% done, the bar might be blue indicating that you're on target. If you have 98% of your class completed, your bar will be green, showing that you are ahead of schedule. This bar is a great tool to help you stay on track. Your goal should be to always have a blue or a green bar throughout every course you take. If your bar is red, then you might need to take some time to really sit down and work through your course until you've caught up. If you want to see more details about your course, you can actually download your course report. To do this, head to the right side and click on the Course Report button. This will download your report directly to your computer, not inside a Genuity. Go ahead and open this document up. This report will have all of the details regarding your course. Now let's break these details down. First, let's take a look at your activity section. This section shows all of the lessons, quizzes, and tests in your entire course. If you are curious about how long each activity will take, you can look at the estimated time section. This predicts how much time it will take to complete the assigned activity. This can help you with planning your workload, but remember, it's only estimated, so it could take you a shorter or longer amount of time to complete it. Lastly, let's check out your score section. This shows you the score you received for your individual activities. This will help you understand your actual grade. It's also helpful for you to look at this to know how well you're doing in your assignments and also on your quizzes. If you have any questions about your grades, your course progress, or your course report, feel free to reach out to your teacher. They will be happy to answer any questions you may have. But that's it for now. I will see you next time on Frequently Asked Questions by our students.